Developing this morning, the man accused of starting a fire at the One Pulse Memorial is waking up behind bars this morning. He is expected to make his first appearance in court today, and now we are hearing from the man who put that fire out. Fox 35's Nestor Mato reports. The 64-year-old man who police say started the fire will face a judge at 1 p.m. And then hopefully we'll see why he even did this in the first place. I do want to show you some of the damage left behind. You see some burn marks on the fence. Mark Henson, he's charged with criminal mischief. Over the weekend, the One Pulse Foundation posted surveillance video on Facebook from October 12th, where you see a man in a wheelchair set fire to a banner. Henson was recognized and arrested yesterday. It's to set an example that, you know, you can't do things like this anywhere. Anybody's home anywhere, and especially here, this is sacred ground. We already suffered throughout the years, and we don't need more suffering uh, for someone to come showing hate. It was actually a Pulse survivor who said he was committed on tracking down the suspect and helped police in the arrest. In Orlando, Nestor Malato, Fox 35 News. Nestor, thank you. The judge